Hey everyone, and welcome back to another episode of Buy or Nah, the player review series here on FIFA 18. Buy or nah, buy or nah, why you acting trippy? Buy or nah, buy or nah, don't be getting lippy. Buy or nah, buy or nah, we do them player reviews. Buy or nah, buy or nah, the hottest play you too. Now in today's episode, we're going to be reviewing this man, also known as maybe my new dad? Question mark? Because he scored a hat trick for Dortmund. He's been incredible for Dortmund. I haven't really watched too many games to be completely honest, but look at some of these stats. I mean, I added the engine because I think engine is important for dribbling. His ball control goes up to 88, dribbling goes up to 85, balance up to 92, agility to 84, and then it also boosts the pace a little bit where he is kind of lacking, but to be honest, no one except for Timo Werner is fast in this game. Doesn't really have stamina, doesn't have strength, but good shooting stats, composure is a little bit low unfortunately. Um, even though he did score a 96th minute free kick EA But hopefully he does pretty well for us. We're putting him in this squad. It's a really quick squad. I made at work because um, I'm Diligent you can see we have Uth here. You might be wondering why we're using him It's because if you've seen the upgraded FC videos He's actually been really good for us, which is kind of funny because he has a funny name. It's Uth. Okay This guy has this team. So he's got Zaha Lingard Dembele good team so I mentioned this in yesterday's video, but we have these new wristbands, my official merch. It says, dad, question mark or nah. I don't want to make money off this, but I also don't want to lose money. So there's a very limited number of, of these wristbands available. If you're interested in buying one, it's going to be like $2 USD, which is for domestic stuff. But then I have to charge more $3 or three, yeah, $3, which is like two and a half euros or something like that. If you're interested in getting one anyway, just message me longtransactiongaming at gmail.com and uh, I'll tell you how you can get one. Limited number, so please don't hate me. Here's Paco, plays it, great pass. Bang it! We should have scored. He banged that real good though. Win this header. Okay, never mind. Oh, he should have scored Mo Salah. Right foot. Uh, it's Zaha. No, we tackled him, but he still has it and he scored. Excellent. That's what I like to see. Drinking game. Every time you tackle someone and they get it back. Go play Pez. Come on, Paco with Uth. Go Uth. You've got runners. You've got runners. It's mainly mainly Forsberg. Good run. He's onside. Cut it back. It took a deflection. Another. Oh my gosh. Oh, get in front. No. What in the world just happened? What was that? Great save and it bounced right. What in the world? <laughs> Oh, that was hilarious. All right, let's see if Paco can actually do anything with the free kick. 32 yards out. If it's not the 96th minute, does it go in still? No, no, it doesn't. Halftime. We've gotten in some good positions, but Paco has not really taken them. And he scored on two kind of goals. I'm no longer allowed to talk bad about FIFA because I complain too much, so I have to mute myself. Oh, it's Lingard. Frizzane, and he's going to score. Damn it. <laughs> That's really bad for me. We're down 3 0, and it's shambles. Paco gets it back. Hit it for me. Oh my gosh. He takes so long to shoot, but he did finally, and he scores. Good job. That's one. I mean, right here, I'm pressing the shoot button. It, I guess it's just a terrible touch, and that's why he couldn't shoot it. Damn it. Ugh. <laughs> uh. Good play. Here's Paco with it. Go, Paco. Come on. Just keep running. Played up top for Coman. He does well. It's a good finish. All right. 4-2. I skipped the replay myself. Even when they fixed the update, I still managed to mess everything up. All right, Uth. Wait for that run. It's a great run. It's Kingsley Coman with pace. He's got the skills. Still Coman. Finish it. All right. We're still in this because of Kingsley Coman. He's really good, and I haven't really gotten the ball to him, so come on, boys. 4-3. Whoa, that time I didn't skip the replay. I'm confused. It's Forsberg. Still Forsberg. Cuts it back. Still Forsberg. Play it in. Get there. It's Paco. Paco the Taco. Yes! For all. I don't know how we're back in this. Because we played incredibly poorly. But Paco Alcacer has a... He has a brace. And we could still win this. He could get a hat trick. Go Alcacer. And Uth. Through for Uth. Uth is gone. Go Uthi. Go, Uthi, show off that pace. Show off that left foot. What are you? Uth, down, inside. Pulisic lays it off for Bentaleb. Bentaleb, right foot. We scored. 5 4. 
How have we come back? I don't know. I'm not playing any better. This guy's just playing a lot worse. Yes, good tackle. Akanji, no, you couldn't get rid of it. Oh, Pulisic, you freaking legend. What a block. And we, we're going to win because of that. What a weird game. All right, we're going to make a slight change just because I didn't like that formation. Um, I'm taking off Uth and I'm just changing to the 4 4 1 1 second variation. We've got Shinji playing at Cam, who I actually really like. A whole lot of Dortmund, which is great. All right, this guy's got that Malcolm and Toprak. He's got Diego Costa, Gnabry, Saul playing at Cam. That's, I wonder if he's going to switch Kroos. Uh, it's a really solid midfield, though, like a lot of stamina, a lot of energy. And as we know from Goretzka, you can just literally use Goretzka, and he's the entire defense. A bit of a kick clash, which is always super fun. Shinji. This is why I love Shinji. Oh my gosh, Paco finished it. I didn't even press a button. He's offside anyway. <laughs> Play it through. Come on. He's through. Come on. So fast. Come on. Don't get caught. Come on. I've been waiting all episode to say that. Oh, go Pulisic. He's pretty fast himself. Can he center it? Hits it. Paco. That was such a bad touch. I wanted him to hit it first time. Oh my gosh. Oh, that was really good for Malcolm. Near post, I'm kind of... I didn't expect my keeper to get beat there. Alcathair. Back for Alcathair. Finish it for me. Yes, Paco. Good finish. I did a time finish for some reason. But I really didn't need to. Hit the underside of the crossbar and went in. He's got another goal. He's actually... He's on three, which is pretty good. Because it's hard to score. For me, at least. Come on. For Paco. Down. For Shinji, who plays it for Pulisic, Pulisic, back for Shinji, one more for Paco, who hits it, that's nice, that was really good, that's why I like Shinji, Shinji does not have a delay, Paco Alcacer, he's not really good at a lot of things, I have to say thus far, but he is good at finishing, he's also good at having his replays be skipped, so that's also a hidden gem, not a terrible half, not a bad player, and um, I mean I'm pretty happy, the formation change is good, Shinji has come in and made an impact. Kroos, down for Carvajal, back to post, that's actually such a good ball, <laughs> Canabry, oh, Surge, what are you surging for, oh, he's through, no, that's so bad for me, Mertens comes on and immediately makes an impact, just cute, I, I have a tendency to want to defend, which is so silly of me, no, oh my gosh, how did Costa get that much on that? He's running away from goal on his left foot. I don't know. Can you tell me? We're in trouble here. Stop that cross. We didn't stop it. We can't get... Damn it. We just couldn't get close to the ball. Oh, 4-2 now. Want a header? Yes, Paco. Come on. Hat trick. Get the ball. Get the ball, Paco. I'm surprised he won that. He's 5-9. But he got up pretty well. Here's Paco, wide, Pulisic, into Paco, plays it wide for Benzaleb, who's going to pull it back, he does really well, still Benzaleb, you got to finish, you freaking mug, that's why you play for Schalke. Full time whistle, unfortunate, we didn't play too well, Paco did get a hat trick, so I mean, I, even though we're not really playing too well, at least Paco is scoring goals, and that's what this whole series really matters. Final game is coming up against a BPL squad, and he's for some reason playing Messi Lingard on the left. Just because his name is Messi doesn't mean he can play as a ling linger. <laughs> a linger. Oh, cut. There's Alcacer looking for a pass. Plays it. One more through. One more for Alcacer. It's a good run. Can he get there in front of David Luiz? Oh, he didn't bite it at all. Lingard plays it down. Erickson, dang it. 1-0. I got caught running the wrong way. That's not really how you want to defend. You want to run the right way. No. What in the world? Why did my center back not clear that away? And then how do you get beat near post there? That is nonsensical. Okay, they're still with it. Trying to draw in the defender. Getting around. That's a pen. Oh my gosh. 
Why did he just die? In. It's gonna be Paco, who turns. That's brilliant! Oh, what a save by Leno! Oh my gosh, that was really good from Alka there. Come on, we're this. Win it! Yes! Akanji! Good jump! 2-1, back in it. Good header. You made up for that terrible mistake you had earlier. Rashford thinks it. No, that is a great ball. Damn, 3-1. Halftime. I mean, we're playing okay, but I don't think the formation... To be honest, I shouldn't be using such a terrible team. But I'm too lazy to really change it. So we're just going to change formation. Here's Paco wide. Plays it back for Pulisic, who got a burst. Gets it wide inside for Pulisic. Left foot. Left foot. Comes out to Coman. He's offside. Damn it. It's so unlucky. Kagawa. Great ball. Can Paco get in front of Christensen? He does well. He plays it for Shinji. Back for Paco. Hit it for me. It gets blocked. Bentaleb. It's get it gets blocked. <laughs> I don't know why under her are so mad, but Shinji Kagawa is yelling at him. Is this a pen? Don't you love FIFA? Paco, step up. I don't have an arrow anymore. I'm confused. Good. Okay. I don't care. We scored. Headers out. That's brilliant. Because I called my keeper. I wanted him to come out and just not even do anything. I pressed all those buttons. Yes, I pressed the... Do the Bernie in the middle of the pitch. Alcacer plays it. Get there. Come on. Cut it back. Still Kingsley does really well. Inside. Four. Alcacer first. Why does everything get blocked? It's a block simulator. Kagawa. Through. Can Paco do something? He's through, but it really means nothing. Play it down. Back post. Shinji. It's going to fall. Paco. Win it. Win it. We won it, but to nobody. Full time whistle. All right, so that's going to do it for the Paco Alcacer review. He had six goals in three matches and an assist, which is actually really good. I mean, a brace, a hat trick, and then one goal. So he scored every single time, which is more than I can say about some of the other players we've reviewed thus far. But he's not, he's not good. He's, I d don't buy him. He's just slow. I'm like nothing in terms of his stats really stands out. He has good shooting, which is why he can score. But I thought with the reactions and the balance and agility being boosted by engine, as well as pace, I thought he'd be better. But on the ball, he's just so slow and turns like a truck. I mean, he could be okay if you want to invest in discard informs. He's only 13k. You could probably get some closer to even 10k or discard amount because Marco Royce has a good chance of becoming player of the month. So then I could see an inform Borussia Dortmund card necessary for that. Or even if it isn't necessary, you can just sell on the hype because others will think that. So this part, this card probably is going to be worth more in just a matter of weeks. It's enough for me. He goes into the black pit of death. We haven't had a buyer yet, so I don't know. Maybe I'm just not playing too well because when I get onto this account, I try to score really quickly. And you have to do slow build up play. At least I do in FIFA 19. And I'm not good at that yet. Anyway, I hope you guys did enjoy the episode. If you're interested in getting a wristband, send me an email at longtransactiongaming at gmail.com. Should be on the screen and in the description and in the comments and in my heart. I'll see you guys next time. As always, don't forget to spare pets.